So I got some new gear that I want to show you guys. I did purchase uh, two mic, mic preamps uh, made by Golden Age Projects or Golden Age Project. It is the Pre 573 Premier Vintage Style for the 500 Series Rack Format. All right, so I'll read a little bit on the specs. Which are the Venture Style Electronics, UK made Carnhill Transformers, uh, Tantalum and Polystring Capacitors. I don't know if I said that Polystring right. If I didn't, however, don't judge me, please. Uh, flexible mic line and instrument input does has that. What we would expect on a mic preamp. Uh, high max gain 80 dB, typical. Uh, selectable high pass filter. And it does has a air EQ band on here. You, you like the mod EQ sort of the air band, but it does has one uh, air EQ. You flip that switch, toggle that switch, and uh, you can get that air band on there. Nice, which does sound nice. Uh, you can't get the three band EQ on this um, here, but I guess because it's a 500 series and it does have room for the three band EQ. But they do have desktop versions which have those um, uh, that has those on there, like the three band EQ with the mic preamp. So you can get that on the desktop version. So yeah, it, it does has um, uh, says great 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 sound that suits most for sound sources and genres. Phase input impedance uh, you get, which is three hundred ohms and a switch and a twelve hundred ohm switch as well. You get DI input, you got a passive DI input, you got a high pass one and a high pass two filter select switch on here, which is great, really good, sounds really great. Uh, of course, the mic line um, instrument it's going to your line input and vocals, whatever, when you're recording for your mic. Um, and, you know, that's pretty much, oh, that has a, a plus 10 dB. Um, Boost your gain up 10 dB. It has uh, it has a switch also 5 dB if you want to boost it 5 dB or you want to boost it 10 dB. So it does has that as well. So they're giving you some good things on here on a lot of good bells and whistles on here as well. Um, this is my 500 series module, my lunch box that holds the modules. You can use different uh, chassis that will hold your 500 series. So this is what the sucker looks like. Here are the two right here. I know you see a Great River preamp right here, but uh, I have these right here. <laughs> so the input switches, um, great. And you can hear them, you know, that typical knee switch and smooth outputs, which very smooth is, which is very smooth. Uh, I'm not going to toggle too much with the switches. I have everything set the way I like it, but these are the preamps. Okay, so why I have two of them. Well, I have two of them because I like to sometimes sum out of my door into my summing mixer. The summing mixer, which I do have, is a uh, passive, where well, it has a passive output. And it also has uh, output one and output two, which is a, a, this has a preamp to, you know, bring the sound up to a nominal level. The passive output doesn't. So you have to have an external preamp to do that. And these, one of the reasons why I got these to do that. So it'll bring that level up. So it do, does give, you know, my sound, or uh, open sound, open the dimension a little bit more space, a little more beefier, you know, on the low end. Uh, I like that. So it did do that for me, with a, which is what I did expect to come through my uh, summing app. Uh, also, uh, vocals. I use it for vocals and instruments, of course. But I did record a song that I'm about to play. Oh, and don't let me forget, please like and subscribe and hit that notification button so we can get more videos out to you and also i have some upcoming videos that's great and show you how i function and do things in the home studio so it might be some things that you may have around the house that you may have a question or, or in looking for an answer to that i may have so check it out and check out the other videos that i uh made in youtube on here on youtube as well uh to function in your home studio so getting back to the subject about these preamps um you can find these in any retail store, Sweetwater, Guitar Center. Uh, they'll run about $4.49. If you do want the desktop versions, they do have those as well. Um, a little more. I think it's about 500 bucks for the desktop. And it does come with the EQ, the three-band EQ. So 
Uh, if you need that, you can definitely have that. And they do have a desktop junior premium junior version, which is just the microphone preamp itself. So you do you do have those capabilities to get that if you choose. Um, and I think the sound is a very ex exceptional sound. I'm very satisfied with it. Um, and I think you will, too. You know, if you're on a budget trying to get a Nevis style preamp, if you're on a budget, um, check this out. It's another option for you. However, there are a lot of other options out there. But if you're on that budget and that price range, I thought it was great for that price range um, and the quality for that price range of $449. So, hey, you can't beat that if, you know, you're trying to save on the pockets, you know, the pockets are a little light, you know. Hey, that's not a bad idea, especially with all this holidays and stuff coming up. You want to give, hey, that's something you can get your, your man or your woman, whatever, who, a producer or something, or a singer, or artist, whatever. So I did use it with the vocal chain. <clears throat> My vocal chain was, um, I used the Avatone C12 uh, mic that was also modified by Black Lion Audio. And I ran it through, obviously, these preamps. Also, I use a CL, CL1B uh, compressor, the uh, Lindencraft compressor. Uh, I can't afford the hardware, so I use the plug-in. So it did the job for what I needed to do, and it sounded pretty good. So I was pretty pretty much satisfied. So that was my vocal chain that I used it through. So check out the song that's about to be ready to play, and tell me what you think. Leave something in the comments and tell me what you guys think on the vocals. How do you like those vocals uh, using these preamps? Um, and get back with me. And I'm out of here. Can't wait to see ya. Looking so fine, man, you're blowing my mind. Can't wait to see ya. Sitting up here thinking about you all the time. Yo, I met this beautiful, gorgeous, fine specimen through a mutual friend, and that's a blessing. She caught me unexpected by surprise. I knew it when I seen the brown eyes. She got the nice smooth hips, ass and thighs Versace perfume on the neck Man, she come close, I'm putting that ass in check And bet, you on top of the world, girl Can't wait to see ya Looking so fine, man, you blowing my mind Can't wait to see ya Sitting up here thinking about you all the time Can't wait to see ya Lingerie coming down from them pretty thick thighs Can't wait to see my little shorty close to me I love it when you touch all over me I love it when you say the way I make your body shake got your knees trembling all over me hey what am I supposed to do a fine little shorty like you I can let loose I'ma lock you down there will never be another like me in your bedroom can't wait to see ya looking so fine man you're blowing my mind can't wait to see ya sitting up here thinking about you all the time Shorty